All right, so I know I'm a day late on this review and the reasons for that is school, basically. School, school is more important than YouTube for me. If I was, even if I was a big YouTuber, school would be more important for me. So in this episode, Itachi runs away from the fight and says, I'm going with Nagato now. Like, really? Also, I want to point out that Naruto used Sage mode in this, and Nagato was still alive when Itachi mentioned that. So did Naruto train in this dream world, just train to get Sage mode for no reason, or just to get stronger by Jiraiya's, um, by Jiraiya's help or what? Or is Jiraiya still, or is Jiraiya dead and Naruto just, I, I don't understand. I guess Nagato never attacked the village because he's still alive. And Naruto has Sage mode at this point as well. So this is an alternate world. This is a dream world. So I was wondering about that during the episode. I was like, hmm, like, like what happened there? All the tail bees got together. Their third, the three tails, I forgot his name. He hit Killer B with his staff thing. And Killer B took the attack saying, we're all friends. So I guess Killer B's dream um, just, just was getting all the Chinjuriken together and being friends with them, basically, because they were all separated. And the Chinjurikens, the tail bees, I mean, they were all together at one point. So I guess he felt the need to bring everybody together and become their friends personally, because being Chinjuriken is a crazy thing. Even in these villages, they resented him and stuff. But to have people around you that understand how you are inside also with a tail beast, I guess could be seen as comforting. And I understand Killer Beast's mindset in the street world. That was really nice. The princess that they were talking about with the ten tails, I, I'm thinking of who it is. I'm not going to spoil it. And this is not even the manga, but I have like maybe a nice idea of who it could be. And when Sasori and Dedara, um, they were fighting, basically all the tail bees turned giants, turned big, and they all Biju Damas against the ten tails that they ran away. But before that, the scene with Sasuke, he came, he comes in, Naruto tells him, Itachi's looking for him. He's like, oh, Orochimaru, I, I quit, bye, boom, and leaves. Like, what the hell? And then the giant snake that Orochimaru summoned versus the tail beast. Them just like punching them like this, like, what, what the hell? And Orochimaru and Kabutu shed their human skin, became snakes and ran away. That was like a really comedic part of it. My favorite scene in this episode, however, was when it, they all turned into beams of light and change their costumes into the, I believe Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 3, was it? Costumes, DLC, white DLC costume. That was really cool to see. I guess they here promoting it by the game, you get the costume. That was really nice to see. Um, I think Killer B's dream is over. Killer B, in the end, they all got together. Uh, and I, I didn't watch the trailer for next week's episode. Hopefully this is over. It's been two episodes already and ended right now. We still got, I think, Road to Kiba. Um, not gonna harm or what's his name, Shikamaru and other people. So I can see why they said this might go on until 2016, even though not real. The canon, the manga ended, but the canon material is being left behind because Toy Animation wants that money with the fillers. Overall, I enjoyed this episode. But since it was a filler, I was not really happy watching it. When I actually got on my laptop to watch it, I was like, yes, new Naruto episode. Then I see Killer B and I just remember, yeah, this is a filler, but since it's Naruto, uh, I'll enjoy it. I don't really care. So overall, I give this a filler a 7 out of 10. It was, this story was, wasn't really that good in my personal opinion. I like the tail beats on their shoulders and stuff. That was all I really liked. And the fights were crap. To tell you the truth, the fights were crap. You could see that Toy did not want to spend money on a filler, filler fights because the fights were really short and crappy. So yeah, overall, like I said, seven out of 10. I hope you enjoyed this video and remember to have a great day. Wow, I just hit something. So have a great day, Shidori.